Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue with Steam Deck. Users are getting the error something went wrong while displaying the content. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, in the basic step, if you are using or if you are onto the Steam beta build, I highly recommend to switch it to the stable build. To do so, open up the settings of your Steam Deck. Now right in the settings menu, from the left pane, click on the option settings, click on the option system and you will find the option of system update channel under beta participation. From here, under the drop down list, make sure to choose the option stable. After doing this thing, save the changes, go ahead, restart your Steam Deck and this will fix out the issue. If this method failed to work out, first of all, switch to the desktop mode. Launch the settings and right under the power settings, you will find the option of switch to desktop. Click on it. You need to launch the Steam and then go to the Steam icon and choose option settings. From the left pane, click on the option download and you will find the option of clear download cache. Go ahead and click on it. It will ask you to confirm the cache. Simply click on the option confirm. This will clear all the cache and then it will restart the steam, log in with your credentials and this will resolve the issue. And if nothing works, the only reason why you are getting the error something went wrong while displaying the content is because of the Decky Loader plugin. Either uninstall these plugins like Deck FAQ, Deck Settings, Controller Tools, MicroOS Deck, Notebook, or I recommend to completely uninstall the Decky Loader plugin. And to uninstall, simply launch the setup just like you have installed this plugin. And at the time of installation, there is a way to uninstall the plugin. Go ahead and simply uninstall it. And if this plugin is really important to you, you need to make sure that the plugin you are getting is up to date. So for that, here is the official website, scroll down and click on the option download and download only the latest plugin and then install it in your system. Else I highly recommend not to install if you are getting this particular issue again. And if still you are need, you can download the latest version right from this official website. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.